Hey guys, Mr. Jaeger here, and welcome back to our Fallout Fallout. In the last episode, we did a bunch of things. First of all, we destroyed the Institute. Yes! Well, that's pretty much the only thing we did. We guided Liberty Prime to his destination and blew up the living crap out of the Institute and destroyed it from the place. So, now if we have a look at our little old map, uh, we basically have encountered... Uh, a little bit of a map, a math, mat, a mathematical, a uh, map glitch in a sense, because now that's not there. <laughs> we just need to remember that that's actually a giant crater, which is even more hilarious. So the institute is no longer here. However, all is not good news, unfortunately. Uh, you may be wondering why a we're still in. Do we? St I can't remember. You may be wondering why a uh, we are still in the. Um, Oh, yeah, we need to get rid of those two. I'll sell those. Ooh, I'm muzzled. Yeah, that's the one we have, so we'll just sell that. So, you, as I said, you may be wondering as to why I am still at uh, Red Rocket. And basically, that is because... We'll just throw that away. So, do we have a flamer? We do have a flamer. Good to know. So, I can get rid of this one. Woo! -hoo! Free stuff. <clears throat> While we're still at the place known as the Red Rocket is because, unfortunately, we're going to have to relocate. It's a real shame. It's a real, real shame. Well, actually, what we're going to do is we're going to investigate, then potentially relocate. Now, the reason for this is because, well, when I go to, uh, whenever I come back here, I don't know why, but it's a thing that I've noticed in my last playthrough, and it happened a lot, in fact, every time, in fact, is that the super mutants would come. A patrol would just miraculously come out of that forest and start randomly attacking me. No matter how long it would be, I'd be here, I'd be rejigging my equipment, and then all of a sudden I hear gunshots because dog meat started attacking them. So, unfortunately, I love this place, and I'll certainly still occasionally come to it, but I think I'm going to try and utilize, and also because it's a new year, new thing, we're going to try and see what this other place looks like, and, um, you know, see what it's about. So, we're going to go back to Sanctuary, because this is a modded player house. It's actually a player bunker from the mod description. Um, it is known as the Lima Department, or Lima Project. I think I saw the Lima Department. My brain is amazing at forgetting things I've just read. It's so stupid. You look at a word. You, you look at a uh, number of words. A number of... Oh, God. Okay. You look at things. Things don't stay in brain. There we go. Coffee injection, please. Ah, glorious coffee. It makes my brain work. So, GG. So, we actually have to go back to Sanctuary, a place I didn't think I'd ever want to go back to. And we need to now go to... A root cellar, because apparently there's a footlocker there that has some things which we may be interested in. We'll sort of say this is the beginning phases of that. Hey, it's the trader. You know what? Huh? Hi. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Kind of already late for that. Let's see what you've got. Oh, I have a little bit of everything. That's good to know. Right, do you have an alien blaster? Oh, I didn't think so. Right, well, what we're going to do first of all is we are going to sell that really horrible machete because I don't like it. Let me guess. You're going to sell it for like shit tons more though. And also I'll get rid of that because I don't want that. We'll also have a look at the armor as well. I don't really need light greaves of the lucky. Chest piece of the punishing. It's all silly, isn't it? Um, mods as well. Well, what we could do also is sell the drink that we don't need. So we can get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of all you, get rid of Medex because that's addictive, get rid of Buff Out because that's addictive, Mentats is also addictive, sell the Psycho as well, Psycho Tap, get rid of the Jet. Okay, I think we're all good. So what I'm going to request from you, ah, this is perfect, I'll get request all of this, because I can. <laughs> Uh, 10 round, no, 5 point. Ooh, yes, we could do with that. And that. Right, 5 mil rounds, where are you? Ooh, yes, and yes. Uh, also... Yes, because... Oh, no, that's a little bit too much. Uh, no, we'll take the shotgun shells. I'll take all the shotgun shells, because that's actually kind of important. And you don't value shotgun shells as much as I do. <laughs> uh, oh. Yeah, all good. Could have really done with that. Oh well. 
So I have to pay you like three quid, but then I can give you that, and that makes me more money. Yes, glorious. Yes, it's a glorious trade. Mm hmm. Found like a. Uh, Miyazaki? Is that the name? Oh, I'm actually going to sell you my mines. I don't use mines. I very seldom use mines. That's the thing. Cryo mine. No. I don't use mines. I don't need to use mines. And that means I can grab all of your rat, your ammunition for your 45. Ah, oh, I love it. And for good measure, I'll take all your flame of fuel. So in a sense, you get a slight trade-off. Awesome. Right, so now that I've sold all the useless junk, I can actually get on with the day, which is nice. But yeah, I have no need for, um, no need for all that crap, so. I mean, mines are nice, but I don't need, I, the, the time I use, in the time it takes me to use mines, I could just have thrown a grenade. You know, I've rolled with this game long enough to know that I'm not a miney person. Okay, so there's apparently a footlocker in this environment. Apparently, there's a footlocker. Aha! Right. Thank you, dog meat, for getting in the way. I'll take you. Started cap. Right, so there's an old hollow tape, so we gotta listen to this this old hollow tape. Let's have a listen, shall we? Ooh, no, it's not. Use uh, military installations. Of all military installations in the greater Boston area. Ooh, okay. So, this particular bunker is an old military installation. This could be intriguing. See, one thing I will say about this game. At least, um, one thing that I didn't... I mean, obviously, in law sense, it makes sense. But in other respects, it's a bit of a shame. Is we never really got to see any... Um, any remaining efforts of the inst of the you know, the um, enclave? That would be a shame. Like I get that in Broken Steel, they the Brotherhood did destroy them. I never played um, Broken Steel though. Unfortunately, that was a for that was part of the DLC packaging. That was when DLC was becoming a thing, when people were still sort of against it in a sense. And because I bought the X because I this was all on 360. And this was, so when I bought the 360 edition of Fallout 3, I only I got the standard edition because it was like a pre-owned or whatever. So I, I didn't re back when I was when I was younger, I didn't really buy many games. If any of you guys are console players or ex-console players, pre-owned. That was the that were the good old days. What was that? Hello, what what's that? Something's over there. Something is over there. I just saw some movement in the trees. And it looked like something was flying. I don't like that. Right, let's get the old... The wrong... No, I don't have any ammo for that, do I? We'll stick with what we know. Oh, what's that? It's flying. What is that? What is that? Is that just a crow? Am I just overreacting? Oh no, there's... Oh, there's some kind of trader going on over there. Oh, you're shooting. Oh, okay. For a second there, I thought it was like some guy was being attacked by... Um, I'm not going to lie. Cazador. If someone said Cazador, I would have run. Right, so apparently this is the place. Hidden... Hidden Valley. <laughs> and dog meat's going for a swim. Okay, let's... Let's do this. Hidden Valley entrance. Not entirely sure where this is going to lead us, but I'm curious. Now, this is, of course, not part of the game. This is a mod that someone made uh, with a DLC in mind. Um, he, st he stresses in the description a DLC-mindedness. I didn't read too much, but he did say... Ooh. Right. I'm getting the good, fuzzy, warmy feeling inside that tells me that everything is okay. Shit. What's that? Remnant Trooper. Oh, shit! That's not a good sign. Two freaking Enclave guys. That's not good. Pulse Grenade or Frag? You know what? Plasma. That's not good. Okay, I seldom do this, but I think you're worth the shot. 
What the fuck? What level are you? I mean, I know I missed, but still. Wow, that did nothing to you, did it? Oh boy. This is not good. Oh god, our weapons are shit. Right. Ooh, Lone Wanderer. That might be a good thing. But right now, I probably should do with bigger booms. Explosives. Maybe I should do that, or maybe I should do that. 80% more damage. That's nice and all, but... Or should I do that? You know what? We'll do that. Less damage. And I increase my carry weight. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. Right. What's my most powerful weapon on me? Apart from that. 219. Yeah, my suppressed CS5. Looks like it might be that I might have to grab myself a, uh... Right. No, they're not going to be able to make it here. How can I not hit these guys? Get my sniping rifle. Where are you? There you are. Okay, it looks like I might have to pull back. And get myself my... Yeah, fuck this. We're going to have to go... Uh, oh, bloody hell. Right, so we're going to have to go back to Red Rocket. And grab my power suit. Because... Jesus Christ. They followed me. Shit, they followed me. Ah, but this is good, because it means now I can take one of them out. Fucking hell. Did both of them come, or just one? Both of them followed. That's not good. But this is good, in a sense, because I can. it's now my turns of engagement. I can fall back and really start hurting them. What levels are these guys? I know this guy didn't design it with my mods in mind, but still... So glad I bought those rounds off uh, the, tra the traveling caravana. We can just cripple. There we go. That's a headshot. Just blew your armor off, bitch. Right. Quick saving. I kind of wish that the, whenever you blew off a person with super armor, the headshot would be pretty much the guaranteed kill shot. Shit. What I'd give for a nuke a grenade right about now. A warning growl. Yes. Uh, on the how fucked scale... Oh shit, we haven't got much uh, health left. Uh, right. Yeah, it's my my most powerful weapon. Oh, no! I could do better. For once, I could request some assistance, and I'd actually get it. Awesome sorceress. Get some pulse grenades out. Hopefully this isn't game-breaking. Takes a few minutes for it to arise, so we'll just wait calmly. <laughs> Are you, brother? Come on. Where the hell's my brotherhoods of steel the way you need them? Right, keep engaging, keep engaging. Sup? Fucking Gatling laser. 
I'm having that gun, you know. You're probably inside the place, aren't you? Where is my Brotherhood of Steel ally? I'm waiting for my helicopter to come. Oh dear, we have less than 100 uh, rounds. This could prove problematic. No, 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 no. You're not leaving this place. Ow! Yeah, finally got you, bitches. This is awesome. It's taking me a while, but it's awesome. Where is the bloody reinforcements I requested? Jesus Christ. At this rate, I'll have killed them before they've arrived. I'm running out of hit points. And extra... Ammo and health. Fuck's sake. These fuckers have really good accuracy. I know what I can do. Aid, expired painkillers, and <laughs> sealed painkillers. Because why not? Let's get addicted to something, right? Okay, let's grab... That wouldn't be a bad idea. If it wasn't for the fact that my freaking... Right, well that's going to be my second weapon I'm going to use. That would be my option for that. Explosives. Give me another vertebrae grenade. You know what? I'd like a return policy on those freaking things. Oh, fucking finally. About time you showed up. Never have I been so disappointed by you guys. But hey, you're here. Any assistance would be appreciated. Here we go. Even if you're just mobile cover. Well, distraction is more accurate terms. Sup? Nice! Shit, flanking. I don't board the damn thing. I need you. Ah, oh, talk about useless. Oh shit. <laughs> Okay, two more. Two more and then we're done. Hey, how you doing? 
Hey! Ray! Fuck you. I will take your food. I will take all of your shit and grab all the important crap. Fuck you. Yes! Got rid of your gun, bitch. And I killed her. Fantastic. Hmm. I need of that. I may have need of that. Fantastic. I got you, bitch. Right, okay. One down. One down. I'm having that gun. Right. Now we just need to figure out how to uh, get your friend. Of which I need ammo for. A lot of ammo. I'll take the mile at me. I will just take the mile at me. I used to using a regular old LAS rifle. This is like the most intense firefight I've ever had. You don't get distracted easily, do you? Fuck's sake. Ugh, I can't think of any other fucking weapon. Right. Just go for body shots. I can't tell you how useful this rifle has been to me this entire playthrough. Come on. Yes. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> Same predicament, eh? Come on. Headshot. A couple more headshots, I swear to you. This is not good. One more. Yes! Suck it, asshole. Jesus Christ. Holy crap. Look at all that shit. A remnant uniform. It's ridiculous. <sighs> Mark 6. Wait, that's like the most ultimate form of power suit. I'm fine with it. Worst case scenario, where we, we'll find we'll find them. Like, the higher level you get, the more, uh, like suits of XO1 power armor you get. Because the way that the leveling system works in this game is when you find suits of power armor in the Commonwealth, and I know we haven't found all of them, you get some... Yeah, you... Right, I wanted to find... Ah, oh, there you are. Specialist Nubray. I'll take your fusion call, bitch. That's for being annoying. No, I'll do it to your friend, too, because of how annoying you are. Both of you deserve an extra 308 caliber to the head. So, yeah, the exp basically, when you level up in the game, the higher level you go, the more likely, finger quote, you are to find an X01 power suit. There we go. Double tap. Right, so these two have basically died fighting for, a, seemingly, a uh, important place. So, let's go for... <laughs> you just died being an idiot. <sighs> right, let's go explore this place, shall we? Right, so it's now daytime in this... Oh, I did not notice that thing up there. Yeah, I've got a bit of a track record for not noticing shit. If you, uh, if any of you guys have seen episode 8. Uh... Right, there we go. Oh, wow. Well, that's clever. Okay, so what was so special about this place that two Enclave soldiers set, set up shop here? Oh, wow. Hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah? Applicable to all persons deployed on the East Coast operations. Dude, these guys could be from Broken Steel. A lot of military fatigues. How much weight do we have now? Oh, we've got enough. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how many fucking fusion cores did they need? I mean, I know they're using XO1s, but still, they've even got the mini nukes. Ah. Well, 
I'm not gonna lie. This is awesome. Look at all this stuff here. Well, we're here to explore, of course. We are here, admittedly, to explore a lot, but I will take all the shit that I need. Annoyingly, this is becoming a bit of a dangerous thing, because if we're not careful, we're going to run out of ammunition on our old faithful, which means we're going to have to resort to more desperate means. There we go. Oh my god, I got another one? That's a little powerful. Wild dog. Oh, it's just exploring stuff. Field what? Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. No. No, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 you don't do that. You better fucking not do that, or I swear I'll fucking cry. You better not have giant ants. You better not, you ass. You better not have giant ants, or I swear I'll fucking cry. No! I really don't want them to be giant ants in this game. I really, really don't. I already went through- yeah. JESUS! I'm just gonna nick his shit whilst you're shooting that one! Oh, don't tell me we got more of them! God damn it! Oi, I can shoot you! Or not? What the fuck? Yeah, let's leave. Oh, fucking hell, this is bad. <laughs> I'm just constantly on that. Right, yeah, no. I have a feeling we should go through here with, um... That was a pretty terrible song. I can't really sing when... Why? Why do you do this to me? I've already just taken care of your buddies. It's not fair. Fuck you, bitch. I will not fall to a scientist. Okay, to a man. Oh, fuck me. I need to level up, don't I? How many levels by, though? Not very much, apparently. health do I have left? Not much. Oh, Christ almighty. Why is that in aid? The... GG. Right, well, we got Gwyneth Stout. And... Just dog me. Distract. Distract. Okay, okay. Once we take care of this bitch, we are going to get my power suit. Because, oh my god. The amount of crap that has been flowing my way is ridiculous. Also, when I level up next, I'm going to increase the amount of health I get whenever I upgrade my freaking thing. I'm liking this. It makes the challenge... It makes combat really tense. Even though I can quick save at any time. It's like Dark Soulsian levels, which is the, the main intent of this playthrough. Obviously, the guys who I'm facing are way higher level than me, but this just means I have a challenge. No. No, it doesn't do as much damage. Also, it doesn't help that they've got the highest level of Mark VI armor I've ever seen. I didn't even realize you could get up to this level. Bearing in mind, this is the semi-nerfed rifle that I had for years. Years, you know what I mean. Months. Ooh, that's, that's fairly close. 
Right, aid. Yes? No. But, oh. We don't ha Oh, no, we do. Extra health. Yes, please. Oh, good. We've hit the chest region. We now have no armor there. Good. More damage. Son of a bitch. Fuck. Almost out. Jesus Christ. This... I'm going to probably have to make this exploring into a two-parter because we'll be... the amount of time we're taking fighting through. Right. Let's go get myself... Uh... Where, is it? Where, is it? Where 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 is my... There she is. This is my new gun. I could probably do with a scope. <laughs> Can only engage targets at a medium. Also, this thing isn't full capacity yet, so technically speaking, when she this when this girl is at full prime, she'll do over 300 damage. Probably more than adequate against Don't know if this thing overheats. I've not actually got to work with this thing. So, this is what I like about this difficulty. It's forcing me to use weapons I normally wouldn't use. Because, well, I have no choice. Oh my god, yes. No. No. Ah, oh, You tease me. Oi, bye boy. You know it? I've got ammo, but it's taken a while for... Oh, shit. Fuck. Reloading. I got a... No experience gained, though. Helpful. Oh, wow. Okay, what about you? Fiber Miller's holotape. We've got all these holotapes. <sighs> right, okay. I know I said if I found any more... Actually, no. What's my most... What's my, my, what's my second most powerful weapon that I could easily access to? You know what? This'll do. Okay. So, we killed a couple of people in here. Emperor be willing. There's... Oh, there we go. One nuka cola co Oh, my God. This is ridiculous, the amount of crap we've got in here. Oh, this... Once we've cleared this place out, we are so setting up camp here. Definitely setting up camp here. The amount of shit we could do to fix this place up would be remarkable. It's kind of messy. Ooh, key. I think we need to go. Oh, no. Hang on. I got my hazmat suit. This is why. There's a dude over there. There's radioactive material. got no armor to speak of. There's a dude over there without any kind of... Uh... I don't like this. This is very... I mean, I'll take the blood packs and radaways and stuff, but I'm not seeing any signs of... Um... Yeah, I'm going to just keep my... This doesn't feel right. Oh crap we've got here though, it's ridiculous. Once I've taken care of this dude, we'll see what happens. But This is going to be glorious for when we take care of other stuff. What are you though? Friend? Foe? No, not friend. Friend or foe? I'm going to see if he's a friend. Nope! <laughs> 
Whoa! What the fuck was that? Fuck, it's a plasma rifle. Hang on. Plasma rifle and plasma? It's a plasma rifle slash what? Flamethrower? You can make a combi flower? Th th combi thrower? That's a nade. I've got no medical shit on me though. Well, oh no, I do. I do. Hang on. You could call a quantum. It's ironic, isn't it? I'm requiring Coca Cola to save my life. I've got no explosives on myself. This is the most awesome. Ah, oh, I've got no explosives, but I've got a shit ton of ammo. Alright, reload, 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 reload. Dog meat, thank you. Oh, don't tell me you pissed him off. Oh my god, dog meat. I love you so much right now. Eat shit and die, monkey face. Okay, so it looks like he has some kind of access card. Scatter gun. Incend. How many freaking... This guy had everything. He literally had everything. This guy is ridiculous. Right, okay, well... This doesn't quite solve the whole... Right, this doesn't quite solve the whole issue of... Uh, what purpose they had here. I mean, there's a shitload of stuff that we need to take care of, but that'll be for another time. I will take you Nuka Cola. What was on here? Have a look. Uh, array status. Alignment controls fault. Network connection fault. We'll download the array data, maybe. So, what was the other yeah. one? Energy weapons. I'm getting a strong use an energy weapon vibe here. Oh, hello. I am going to have fun looting you. High powered magnet. Holy crap. And a teddy bear for safety. I'll take the 556. Five, I'll take that and I'll take that. No, oh, you love me. I know you do. Any other important details or documentations I should be aware of? No. Well, then fuck yourself. Nah, this is this is a looter's paradise. <gasps> Stimpak, I love you. Okay, so we've take we've understood the fact that this place definitely needs to be fixed. Oh boy, that's a reassuring sign, isn't it? Oh, bloody hell. That's my line. Yeah. Fuck that. Fuck that. <laughs> We're leaving. Bye. Yep. We're leaving. We're leaving. Bye bye. Shit. Once again, taking cover behind shit again. Right. Let's get my. Scavenged. Helmet on. Where are my fashionable glasses? Yep, we're back to normal. Only problem is... I don't have a 50 cal. <laughs> or anything with a big enough punch now. We've kind of buggered ourselves a bit. Just a tad. 
I don't have any ammo for my most powerful weapon. But I do have, 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 have yeah. I do have adhesive, which gives me an idea. Right, so BRB for a few, whilst I figure out how to solve our problem. And also, Emperor willing, not get shot and killed in the process. You gonna follow me? Yep, they I do. They will. Oh shit! Ah, <coughs> oh, lovely. They are not gonna quit, are they? I could lure them to the sanctuary. I could perhaps trap them and uh, get one of my permanent guys to. This is a really nice place to hold a line. I can't fast travel either with those bastards behind me. Oh, wait, no, we're safe. Fantastic. Right. See you when I get back. And we're back. And I'm back for action. I've got my IF-54, which only, yes, does 57 damage. It does, however, have over 1,000 rounds. And seeming as we're only going up against a couple of people, I think I can take them on with my over 1,000 rounds of 5mm worth of fuck you. Also, we've got my railgun. I basically upgraded it. So it now does over 300 damage per minute. Um, and unfortunately, because my science is not up to level 4, I couldn't give it the ultimate upgrade, which would have been it to up to boosted it up to 360-something. But that's okay. Right, so now, with my power suit on... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, lovely. Two fucking power suits. That's what we needed to see. If I could lure them back to Sanctuary, we could... We could inspire the populace to help defend me. As I... As they kind of owe me already anyway. Because, why? You know, I'm, I, I feel it's necessary. And also, I've got nothing to defend myself with, and I need the actual cover, so... Let's do this. So, basically, this particular mod is a battle against the remnants of the Enclave as they uh, attempt to... Yeah, we could do some help, guys. I finally have a use for you. Oh. Yeah, you can run. Yeah! Someone shooting at them? No. Nope. Hell yes. That's right. You all help me out. I give you the satisfaction of an. Oh, oh no! What are you doing? No! No! Get back in, you plan. Dude. Love how you're the first one to instigate it, but then when as soon as it goes wrong for you, that's when you give up the ghost. You know what? We'll go with this. RPG 69. Come on. This is what happens when the ins uh, the enclave gets their way. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Oh no, Codsworth! Shit. Oh no, that was the right gun. That was the right gun. Thank you.
This is awesome. Using the Commonwealth to fight against the Enclave. This is a lovely feeling. We've had so many action-packed episodes lately. It's awesome. Admittedly, a lot of it has been me withdrawing and then uh, me trying to desperately get myself some health. But still, it it's awesome. I like this. This is a nice feeling. Right. Also, Nuka Cola Quantum coming to save the day. Love, mega love going to Nuka Cola today. And slowly but surely, we're going to reduce all their health. Bloody hell. If only my damage level was slightly higher. Damnation! They're only targeting me. Oh yeah, we've got the medical medical pump as well. Which is nice. That's also really handy. Ow! Shit. Suppose you won't get like distracted by dog meat, will you? White picket fence, save me! <laughs> Sup? You <laughs> figured you could take on. Alright, I'll leave this unarmored man with a pipe rifle, with a pipe pistol, versus the Enclave Mark VI power armor. That's a very bad idea. Don't get pinned. Don't get pinned. Don't get pinned. Is there a third one? No, it's just the same one. Right, we'll take care of this guy. I've got no eyes on. Fucking hell. This is. Oh, this is probably the. Oh, I'm loving this. It's a difficult thing, but... Oh, this game. Oh, did we get him? Fantastic. We got him. I'll take all their things, but... Right, reloading. Is that him? That's him. That's right, asshole. Commonwealth is against you, and you know it. Of course, you focus only me. shoot his toes. Well, wait, did you nick his pistol? You did legit just nick his, someone just nicked his pistol. That's safe. Who's shooting who? Why are we still shooting? What? Oh. And a block flyer wanted to jump in on the action. That's just nice. <laughs> well... Holy shit. Hey, Carla. Need to pick something up? Lives pretty long from here. Indeed it is. Let's see what you got. You break it? You know, I'm going to have I am going to have all of your GG. Uh right, we'll start with medical shit first of all. Do you have any stim packs? <laughs> yes, you do. I'm taking all of them. Thank you. Um Right, what can I not? My armored jumpsuit. Well, I can sell that, because that's rare. Same goes for you two. I'll... S I'll get this as well. Uh, oh, no, I need that on me. I I'll tell you what I can give you, though. I'll give you some bad batch jet. Buff out mentats. Cut stout. Some rotten fish. Uh, what else? What else can I sell you? What other weapons do I not need? Uh... Plasma scatter gun. You know what? I'll sell you that. I might as well sell you my plasma gun as well, because I don't need that. And instead, I'll give you. You can give me, sorry. Uh, you've already given me all the ammunition I could take, so. There you go, I'll just give that. I mean, these guys are loaded with plasma guns, so especially that officer back there, so. That's pretty much the thing. So we're, we're gonna. We're really gonna start struggling against these guys, which is a bit of a worry. But I am going to be able to take a lot more stuff, which is kind of beginning to game break now. But that's only when I'm running around outside of my power armor suit. So yeah, this is definitely going to be like uh, a mini saga, if you will. Uh, tale, I, should, I might add this onto the end of the thing, so the tale of the... Uh, the last en enclave soldier, or something like that. Just ta tales of the last en en yeah, tales of the last enclave. Because 
Basically, we've got an enclave establishment that's only now just become aware of us. And as a Brotherhood of Steel commando, or paladin, it is my duty to eliminate the remnants of the of the vile people of the enclave. And they are truly the bad guys. They're the actual stereotypical bad guys. Um, if any of you guys have... Well, obviously, you guys have played... If any of you guys have played the original Fallout, like Fallout 2, um, they are the ultimate bad guys. And they did... They have come in various forms. In obviously, Fallout 3, they're famous for having been the stereotypical bad guys for you to deal with when um, engaging the uh, Brotherhood of Steel. They're the good... When engaging the Enclave, the Brotherhood of Steel are the stereotypical good guys and the Enclave... Wait, yeah. Brotherhood of stereotypical good guys, enclave stereotypical bad guys, because they basically want to have all non, um, non mutated, uh, like, they want to have uh, non mutated people to be safe. Let me guess, inflect. I'm gonna basically get a freaking laser weapon, and it's going to blow everyone up in like five milliseconds. Okay, so we've already been down there. But, uh, tw ten minutes ago, it was all lovely. Right. Please, Emperor, tell me that this is the last we will see of anyone in this room. How many manuals does that guy want to give, though? I mean, I will say now, this map, uh, sorry, this uh, mod is remarkable. It is absolutely astounding. The amount of crap I'm going to be able to loot from this is ridiculous. Um, to save face, I won't do the, the Sims looting session because it will just be... It'll be amazing, but ooh, I'm tempted in doing it, but yeah, time limitations. Oh, dog meat wants me to do that as well, Bob. Right. Well, let's just first of all make sure that this area is clear. Oh look, there you go. See, there's some power armor. So, so look. Is that T45? No, that looks like T50. Well, either way. What is that? Yeah, that looks like T uh, 50. Oh, let me guess. There we go. Extra weapon damage for energy weapons. Ooh! That's the thing we used to blow up the Institute with. Hell yeah. Really? We, we want to do that again? Yeah, sure. I'll take a couple of mini nukes. I've kind of run out. I'll take some stuff. Holy shit. Right. So I think... Oh my god. Look at this. Oh, I've just got paid back with all my... Oh, oh, I'm coming all kinds of happiness. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh. Why handcuffs? I'm a little... Oh my god. That's a lot of ammo you've just given me. Ooh. Mm. I love this. This is amazing. Ooh, look at all this junk. Ooh. I feel I feel alive. I feel like long live Sparta. Ooh. This is a great way to end the episode. Yes, I love you. You're sexy. You give me all of the ammo's. Yes. Mm. 500 bullets each. How much ammunition does that mean for my 5 millimeter? Ooh, ooh, nearly 3,000 rounds. Mm. I'm going to stick with you. I'm going to love you. And you're never going to see anyone ever else again. Yes. Well, I'm afraid, Sonny Jim's... Yes. Yes, this is going to be where I end the episode. Because, well, if it's going to take this much just to clear out that building, God help me when I go into that building. And also, I kind of want to, you know, get on with other things. So, um, what we will do first is clear this entire place out of Enclave. And then, afterwards, we will then commence with the looting. Because, oh my god, it's going to be a lot. Anyway, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this pretty epic first episode after the Institute's fall. And uh, I will catch up with you next time. This is Mr. Jaeger, signing out.